finalizing Roseville. Drivers may not love it, but city leaders say an ongoing improvement project is continuing a dramatic facelift of that city's downtown. And Mike sells live in Roseville with more on why drivers may want to get used to seeing a lot of construction for, for years to come, right, Mike? Yeah, good morning. And did you know we're just days away from the one year anniversary of the completion of this, Roseville's signature town square? But the work isn't done. In fact, all you got to do is just look right over here to the nearest street, Oak Street, and you'll see it's going to be another day of road work for anyone driving through downtown. This latest road work, part of a new roundabout being constructed. City officials say drivers will be dealing with this road work until the end of the year. But as you mentioned, there could be a whole lot more work to come in the next few years. Just yesterday, the city's economic development director told me the city is already working on plans to build a new 500 plus parking space garage next to City Hall. That would be all free parking. A new or upgraded fire station is also in the works. That would be right next to the roundabout. And then three Three bridges in this area are going to be changed or built to better connect pedestrians downtown to Royer Park just across the river. All of these changes aimed in part at bringing more business success to downtown. We're still at a turning point. I mean, I think we're kind of a beginning of a renaissance for the downtown. Uh, so it's, you know, there are, there are individual cases of, you know, business models that we're seeing success with. Uh, one very successful business that's just celebrated their, their one year anniversary is Roseville Cyclery. Uh, they're doing phenomenally well in there. Now, back here live, there are three things to know about these ongoing changes. Number one, city officials say this road work here will likely last. Till the end of the year, they just completed phase three, moving on to phase four. Then on September 9th, there will be a public open house to reveal and discuss and to show off the designs for those three bridges that they're either going to build or change to better connect downtown to Royer Park, one of the bigger parks here in downtown uh, Roseville. And then number three on September 13th, Sammy Hagar going to perform a concert right here at Roseville's Town Square to commemorate the one year anniversary of the completion of this town square. As the city's economic development director told me, a year ago, things sure did change from a parking lot here to a town square. And a year from now, things could change a whole lot more. So uh, stay tuned to see just how dramatically the renaissance of downtown Roseville continues as this city continues to prove to be one of the fastest growing cities in all of California. Live in Roseville, Mike Tassell, KCRA 3D. All right.